leaving bullying behind in the dust. These James Hargist college students and Invercargill police officers are taking part in a bike ride from Thompson's Bush to Sandy Point to raise awareness for an important cause. Pink Shirt Day, which is to raise awareness against bullying. So police are fully involved in this and we're supported by a school, uh, getting the message out there that it's not okay um, to bully and we're also going to deliver those messages to a school on the way as we ride our bikes. Pink Shirt Day originated in 2007 when two Canadian students decided to wear pink to show solidarity with a student who was the victim of homophobic bullying. Since then the phenomenon's gone worldwide with people coming together to spread the message to speak up, stand together and stop bullying. Constable Laurie says the problem of bullying is significant in the lives of school-aged students in New Zealand. Oh, it's huge. It's huge and it's very debilitating to the people involved, whether they're kids or adults. Um, it is a real problem uh, in our society and uh, you know we need to raise awareness and make a change. And it's close to the hearts of the James Hargis Student Council members. Well, this is going to show that we are here to support anti-bullying and that we're taking a stand against bullying. It's important to stop bullying because it hurts people, it makes them sad and then they don't want to go to school and then it makes their life miserable and other people around them because they feel like they're like having a hard time or in pain and it's just not right. Show everyone that we support them and that we are here for everyone and everyone's unique. The bike ride stopped off at Otatara Primary School where the bike riders spoke with the Year 5 students about the importance of treating people with compassion. I'm Ruby Spink for The South Today.